this is an update for the week of Sunday, October 1st through Saturday, October 7th. This Monday, I went to the doctor about the migraines. I got a prescription for Emetrix. Um, I've used it a few times this week. I'm. It makes a difference. I'm not entirely sold that it's better than what the over-the-counter stuff I use it does. Uh, it does make me a little... I don't know what the word is. I don't want to say lightheaded. But for like an hour after I take it and then after it kicks in, I do kind of... I guess I... It's hard to explain. It does have a, the side effects are not horrible, but I, I, I kind of stagger around a little bit. It's like I'm just not quite a hundred percent there. I found that if I turn too quickly, I kind of get a little dizzy. Uh, it's nothing severe, but it does have that negative effect, and I'm not entirely certain how safe or unsafe that is at work quite yet. Um, but it does seem to help a little bit. I. I don't know if it necessarily takes away the pain and of, of, as much as it makes it more tolerable. What I have noticed is that it doesn't help at all with the exhaustion and that is kind of the point. Um, that's the major main issue with like with the migraines is I, I don't care as much about the pain uh, but it's the exhaustion that is causing me issues. So. Yeah, I, I'm still not 100% with it. I have a, an appointment scheduled for the 2nd of November with my doctor to kind of talk about it and uh, see how things are going and where we're going to go from here. Um, I got some exercises from him for my foot pain, but I haven't really had a lot of pain anymore lately. I did bind my ankle. I have been just because I've had a lot of issues and I have weeks and weak ankles. Walking a lot at Napa has been causing me issues and uh, I know, two and a weeks, two and a half weeks of you know, binding it with some ace bandage on my right ankle and now my foot feels pretty good. There's not really any more pain when I walk and I don't even have to bind it anymore. So I keep, I'll keep doing the exercises but I think that what I did really just helped stabilize it a bit and kind of get me over that bump of whatever that was. Um, my doctor is supposed to be looking into some help with the dyslexia issues. We'll, we'll see how that pans out. I Once again, I kind of think that's going to be something that I'll be tackling mostly myself as I don't feel that there's any way I'm going to be able to afford the therapy because insurance doesn't really cover it um other than that nothing of any real significance is going on I mean that that's a a big step in my future plan was getting in to see the doctor about things so I got that done and so we've made that step forward um from this point forward I'm not going to be doing weekly updates just for the sake of doing weekly updates I don't see the point unless there's like a milestone in the progress that I'm trying to make towards the ultimate goal of you know getting out of seminary and being a pastor I just don't see the point in making forced videos you all don't really need to know that I was tired on Tuesday and you know went to sleep earlier that you know, we went to the park and I played ball with the five-year-old. It's just, there's just no point in that. So, yeah, we'll be uh, releasing videos as important things happen. And if anybody is concerned or wants to talk, you're welcome to get a hold of me directly. And we can, we can sit down and talk or whatever we need to do. Anyways, may the Lord bless and keep you all, always. And I will see you whenever the next bit of important whatever happens.